Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I know you guys are waiting for UFC career mode. I'm waiting on it as well. I've been going through so much bull crap as soon as EA Sports UFC has dropped. Now, first thing I want to let you guys know is I have a digital download version and I have a disc version. I don't want to open up the disc because I'm trying to do a giveaway for that copy for PS4. But my digital copy, um, on the first day that it came out, it took over two hours to install. Once I installed it, I played a few games and then I tried to start career mode. I've been playing on pro difficulty, which is the hardest, and I've been having a lot of fun. But when I tried to start up Game Face, it wasn't working. So I had to go to my EA account. I had to link my origin and I had to link my EA as well as making sure that it linked to my PSN for my Game Face to work. Now EA Sports tweeted me back and told me that they were going to be working on the issue. And now Game Face is allegedly working. But this is the kicker. My Game Face picture that is uploaded to my profile is not the same as the player that is presented to me in the game. Now I'm going to show you guys some uh, previews and images of my fighter, what he's going to look like and all of that. But check it out. What I want to say is for Game Face, they don't put you or whatever player you put on that screen into the game. What they do is they use your image of your face from game face feature put it in the game basically put your face to the closest template that they have the only thing that's probably the same is probably like your eyebrows to your eye everything else is like template based you can't change your facial hair you can't change your regular hair and you can't change like certain appearances in game you have to do all of that via game face on easports.com it's kind of crazy I know a lot of people probably like well that sounds weird because in Madden 15 whatever face you uploaded to game face feature it was actually that face in the game now of course the skin may have been white purple blue black yellow and all of that but at least the face was right so I will have to commend EA Sports UFC for trying to make it more about their game than just your player but now you're looking at the screen and this right here is a nice screenshot of what I look like on the game face feature I know I look pretty dope. I know I look like the man. Hey, that's what it's all about. But I'm about to show you guys a clip of what my player will look like once career mode starts. So what I want you guys to do is inside the comment section, tell me if this player actually looks like me. And you know, we'll get things popping. Also, the beard. I can't change the beard. If I do change the beard, it won't be enough. So your boy is going to have to be rocking this crazy Sony. Oh, also, one quick thing before I get up out of here. I'm, I'm pissed about this EA. The hometown, you cannot be from Philadelphia, and your nickname cannot be The King. I am ticked off. EA, please, for me, for the homie, put a little DLC in there, just add it into the game and just let me know. I want to put my hometown from Philadelphia, and I want to put my nickname as The King. I can be the prince for, for, for a little bit, but once I win that belt, I need to be The King. So, please, EA, do your boy some justice. But um, this is IKC signing out, man. I'm going to holla at you guys once I get these UFC career mode videos popping. By the way, the first UFC video that you guys are going to see is the creation. Then you're going to see all the Ultimate Fighter fights. You're not going to see none of my training. You're not going to have to worry about watching all that bull crap. You're going to get the fights straight from me. So I hope you guys will enjoy it when it comes out. I'm, I'm out of here, man. All I can do is just wait for this game to keep installing. Peace.